Yes, well, guys, you're welcome. I never believed Pere could do such a thing to Maria. Seriously, this reunion was really on fire. I mean, guys, if you know the amount of times that Pere has showed Maria that, see, I want to be very close to you in the house and all that, even outside. Met? Him doing this now. Give me guys an update of what's up and what went down. So if you're new, kindly hit the red subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, comment your feelings below. So why not move out oh, on any of this interesting content? These videos are everything happening around you and beyond. Okay, guys, now let us check out this tweet. Right, guys, looking at this tweet now sharply, you would see uh this one said, In what planets ain't they cute together? You know, that's what uh, someone asked. Now, Maria replied, the person say, Planet, Earth, Mars, Venus, Jupiter, Pluto, and Eramus. Now, Perry went ahead to say, Never cute, please. Sheep is destroyed. <laughs> now, looking at what we call like a banter between Perry and Maria on that particular tweet there, you know that I think uh, uh, Perry has finally given up and moved on. Yes, of course he should because uh, I'm sure that he already know that Maria is already hooked up with Kelvin, that uh, she was uh, always mentioning inside the house uh, subconsciously. Now, uh, the truth here is Perry really wanted Maria by all means. Now, we could remember the times that uh, Maria would be upstairs and you see Perry all over around you know around her having some kind of uh, uh conversations that uh you know sometimes she didn't even want to participate in if, when she moves at Perry follows but one thing i observed that Perry is telling the housemaid something different and also you know coming to tell maria something different at the time it was like uh -uh, what's this guy doing and lots of viewers did not really like the action there so i felt like uh you know maria and Perry's relationship inside the house uh were like uh what i would say if the cameras were not on something would have you know they would have had like a very closer relationship but i feel both of them especially maria was so was very con conscious of the camera like she was she, she knew that people were watching and she knew that kelvin was watching too so i felt like that was what uh should i say um spoil their relationship kind of yes because there we are just at what do people say what do kelvin say for maria's own part now again we also spotted that not only Perry uh, was kind of attracted to maria to cross to was i mean there was one time cross had to sit maria down at the dining area and express himself to her like fully 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 but i think that was when um you know he was seeing j paul and sasuke so i think cross really wanted to just calm down so he said all what he said and maria was like seriously but didn't give it in because i think yeah, she believed or uh, most of the housemates female husbands in the house believe that cross is a player so do you think cross is a player after the comment section what you feel about that one now again uh we also spotted that uh Pere was not only attracted to maria in the house maybe he was trying to take um okay we wouldn't call it taking advantage of but uh, maybe he was trying to like um impress the viewers or trying to like buy favors from someone's fans i think you guys will spot when perry was trying to be close to beatrice yes that was before beatrice left the house he was trying to go very close to Beatrice. i'm just trying to face perry and maria relationship inside the house i think uh part of the persons that uh led to beatrice evictions i think maria and perry were like top most uh uh people that made beatrice leave the house remember they were like white cards they were white cards center inside the house and when they discovered themselves as, as white cards they wanted every means uh, of diversion from people's eyes to go out of there and that was what led to beatrice eviction because the nomination for her she didn't see it coming but for that uh purpose uh it came too fast for her and i think it also affected her emotions her character inside the house completely changed it became very very moody that's beatrice and uh, she wasn't really having uh good conversations with uh, most of the housemates because uh they felt like she is the wild card but at the end of the day it turned out not to be so okay so coming straight up to uh Pere and the housemates and maria i think Pere, maria and the housemates relationship generally a lot of persons did not like both of them, especially when they were, uh, uh, I think uh, Perry was the head of house. That issue he had with white money really caused a lot of, what I would say, banter on social media. The fans were angry, the viewers were angry. When he was like, I am the head of house, you should respect this thing on my neck. 
you know that kind of a thing and he wanted white money out of the kitchen area i think that was like the biggest one of the biggest trend then on social media everybody was talking about Pere as the general i think that i'm sure you guys know that that's where the name came in from Pere the general now i want to ask you a question what do you guys think that uh, Pere did in a house that spoiled his game completely for me i feel that this white money battle and the kitchen thing was it so if you feel otherwise you put on the comment section uh what you feel about this now the second one was uh maria in the picture yes somehow maria participated in spoiling Perez's game one way or the other just vice versa just the way uh Perez too participated in spoiling maria's game that's what i feel now i could remember the time mm, they were having a conversation now part of the strike the early strikes that they have was because of whispering and yes of course you know it is prohibited and i think maria's eviction from the house came too early that's why it's Perez participated in spoiling now what happened was that uh, Maria was becoming like being too free. That's what I saw in her. You know, she was giving some privileges. Yes, that we saw. Now, some of the privileges, one of the privileges was to bring up people that will be of eviction. You know, it's actually the prank time that she did uh, uh, to the housemate. Wow, some of the housemates were feeling like, ah, uh -uh. that means this girl has levels to have this kind of opportunities given to her. But I think Biggie kind of used that method to, to like spoil her game completely although that was uh, the same thing that happened uh, to nini and saga but it was kind of different we're talking about that one in another video yes so so uh generally now i just feel that um you know maria and Pere were cool when they came out of the house they were not having any kind of a uh, banter physical banter but within me i know that there's these two might be liking themselves but for the camera sake they uh they did an ad together that was that ad was a dstv ad uh, that they had together and everybody loved that ad and people wanted to see it i'm sure dstv really took in uh, the right persons for that particular ad there because it went viral it was everywhere yes so and they killed it completely so what do you guys think if you've seen the ad what do you think about it and how do you see uh maria and Perry? that if kelvin was in the picture do you guys think uh maria and Perry like would fit each other with what you saw in the house there you know so many times they had some close uh should we call it gossips or plans about how to take white money off the kitchen and uh, maria was like the mouthpiece sometimes she took she overreacted to the whole thing and i think that's uh, what caused most of the housemates not really liking her and also her early eviction from the house So do you have any reason or you feel like something caused Maria's eviction early enough from the house? Come on put on the comment section what you feel about that one. So as I said Perry disgracing Maria uh, Seriously, you saw the tweet there now. It wasn't what I expected I mean, I was thinking that she just be playing around social media, but this particular one now saying the ship has completely scattered that's the ship is completely destroyed got me thinking so put your comments opinion in the comment section what you feel about that one don't forget if you're new here seeing this video for your very first time can you hit the red subscribe button on the notification bell comment opinions below thank you guys for staying by and see you on the next video bye bye